Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and hello again, Gemini. Alrighty guys, happy October. So here we are. Today we're doing a career and money reading dedicated to you guys during October 2023. Hopefully everybody is doing great. Gemini with an eye, 10 cards. We begin it with the fool. Okay, where is that journey going to take us? So how do we make more money at the role that we're at or with a business idea? How do we find the best career path? success upward mobility is what we are looking to achieve and boy do you ever have power do you ever have strength are you the magician are you the fool oh my god that is big gemini your cards are speaking progress your cards are saying success your cards are saying a breakthrough i don't know there's so many words that i can plug in but let's just begin to say the fool is on a journey and the possibility is amazing success. The fool is on a journey and their possibility is they act like a magician. They wow others. They win. The fool is on a journey and their next step is in a chariot. The fool who once decided to walk. Okay. Look at the magic of this. Once you've decided to actually walk, it's as if a blockage is removed. You've decided to walk and guess what? You get a chariot. You've decided to be you. You've decided to reach that moment of judgment. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's like full stop. It's like, let's reset. It's like reassess. And Gemini has made up their mind. You are owning your own world. This is all about your inner strength, guys. This is all about personal growth, guys. We will talk so many business scenarios. But guess what's happening here? You are growing. You are going through a transformation. You are going through finding your niche. You are going through sparks. You are going through aha moments. It's as if Gemini, and I kid you not, you see that Moldavite I'm wearing? It's as if you bought one of those from our store and you're seeing the change. And it's a positive change, guys. So I go back to saying, from the fool, on their own just because they're following their passion they're getting rewards already with the chariot card and why is it all happening why are we doing this because we had a judgment moment and we've realized somehow something is not fair for gemini the playing field is not level the reward as it compares to the input that you do to the effort that you do is not there so we needed to have that moment there needs to be sometimes those confrontations that level the playing ground. Okay, whether you're in an organization and you said you're prepared to move and they said, hold up, hold up, Gemini, we'll promote you. Or whether you have decided to actually seek a new market and somehow that market decides to smile at you and say, you made the right move, Gemini. It's You're winning either way, guys, and you're winning big. So first result we're getting here the queen of swords okay boundaries parameters of success are defined and now it's time to take action towards money and here's the night of money making the night of money saving and the night of investments the night of coins this is what you got here so gemini this is a moment it almost looks like a tower moment that only you in the world if that can even happen could see it writings on the wall you can tell already this particular and i'm giving a real estate build uh, example here this particular building will need to be demolished somehow they discovered the ground around it is not clean it needs to be demolished guess what it's going to be demolished but something will be rebuilt guess what happens between then and then okay opportunities and you are on top of them nine of wands says it's good that you're making that move quickly because it's also a hot opportunity that comes with a sense of urgency and it's quite near and it's quite fast six of cups six of coins pardon me is just reminding you remember what has worked for you in the past we're not saying you're fleeing town but you're making a bold move or you're cautioning people that you will make that bold move with the right sequence of who finds out when and who does what when you are winning this a timing note here is saying you don't want to procrastinate on this move okay it's a nine of cups it's a it's a nine of fluidity it's a nine of flow 
what else have we got going for you besides the strength card and you being the magician back to gemini the charisma back to gemini being the charisma that they are back to gemini selling their own value merchandising their own skill sets and at times you know what raising the yellow card and saying this does not work this is how it's going to be otherwise i can be in that mode i can be taking off i'll find a better way to do things sometimes guys sometimes all it takes is for us to really show others and i mean that in a polite way that we are fed up sometimes all it takes is for us to really draw a line and mean it i mean and look at this you go from this to this okay it's still the same energy the only thing is now now you're their magician now they want to ask what tools can we provide you or in what better ways can we now do business with your business gemini okay guys 10 cards they quite excite me okay let's throw 10 more and see what else we're going to say to the gemini who is getting not only a status upgrade but the fool is going somewhere the fool pops up again wheel of fortune and what else is around gemini look at all those coins look at all those coins and the moon at the end and the moon and i could say to you guys about the moon this could also be a note around timing so give yourself that give that process a little bit of time anticipate the results they may not be super clear right now but this is going to change i'm seeing here the energy of gemini who is moving i like the six of wands that moves you forward okay i have found ways to overcome my obstacles therefore i've decided to move and i know i'm going to be more and more inspired move in what direction in the direction of making more money there's the knight of coins the knight of let's make more money you have him here also okay so here's the knight of coins here's the knight of coins the knight of coins is a mindset the knight of coins is gemini kind of like the fool but beginning with the fool actually saying hey there's a lot more out there for me and guess what i'm gonna go after it i love you i love you when you do that i love it when people appreciate their own self-worth and take some chances but they mean it we're not just taking a chance on fleeing town we're going somewhere and we're preparing to win at that new okay somewhere so here's the fool move, moving forward to achieve a new beginning i don't know why my cards are tilted now that i'm so excited and guess what do we have an opportunity yes we do it's the wheel of fortune which says to me and maybe says to you gemini yeah you gotta look at other localities you gotta look at other locations you gotta scratch the surface in a bigger way in a bigger way if you've had it with a particular status quo seek success elsewhere you may have a major opening there your question is should i stay or should i go i believe you're answering this i believe you're walking away from a dynamic that doesn't serve you i believe you're walking away from a status quo that appears a little bit more stale and you're seeking something that provides you with the fulfillment but also coins and money coming to your bank account eight of coins just a reminder before we leave before we take off make sure you have packed all your skills make sure you have brushed up on any area of skills or knowledge that you need to so in other words be like a good pilot know what you know and know what you don't know and that's how you are also gaining credibility it's like i don't have to know everything but if i know enough to lead if i know enough to push the phase forward the business forward and i can get some help seeing the way along the way then we can move forward so we're not seeking any procrastination here but we're making sure that you're still at the top of your game whether you are a plumber or whether you are a financial analyst whether you are a mortgage agent or whether you are in science in medicine be at the top of your game check on any elements of recency of certification etc etc because you're going places and it's a promising phase guys it's a brand new phase that will begin right now we're dealing with the moon's energy but with the knight of swords nobody stops you you got the vision with the knight of cups here you're sailing on this opportunity like crazy it's like people know what you can do and people are approaching you and i love the fact that you decided to open the door finally you've opened the door gemini three more cards what to let go of on this big journey 
what to embrace more of and the best path forward and i love it what to let go of staying still what to embrace more of acting when it is rational which in my humble view here we have the elements and the best path forward is you in the sunshine do you see your path the moon is a path and now it's sunshine so gemini with an eye i am super excited for you oh my god it looks like i've been recording also thinking you guys can see here we go pardon me guys <laughs> Alrighty, so that's what excited me. If I was recording without them, that's what excited me. There was your Six of Wands saying we're moving with the priorities. Knight of Coins, and here's the Fool one more time. And there's our Ace of Wands. And there's the Wheel of Fortune suggesting scratching the surface more is a good thing. And here's your Knight of Cups. There is a Seven of Coins, an Eight of Coins, Knight of Swords, and the Moon. Which at the end, I'm saying that moon energy converts into the sun into the big victory into the spotlights into a shining bank account to the point where you are opening up more and more so guys i got excited and i think i may have forgotten to uh, turn the camera down but really what an inspiring set of cards i'm not going to say what an inspiring reading but i hope you think so but what an inspiring set of cards that popped up for you guys to me the biggest deal was going from fool to the chariot it's as if the moment you decide to be you is the moment you are upgrading yourself is the moment you are truly winning a status you deserve that was my reading for you guys which i hope you liked let me know what you thought and as always you guys should know we do love you madly and bye for now guys